Hello and welcome back to the Project Hercules Diaries. Today I am CAD modelling and in case you don't know what that is, that is cardboard aided design. No computers in this one baby. Um, for the fuel tank and I've done a bit of a redesign on the fuel tank because the, the original cardboard model uh, really had no volume at all and I wasn't really going to get much fuel in so uh, and the, the issue I had was that it was easy to get a vertical side profile but as soon as you start to move those pieces out the angles change and the height changes and I wanted to maximize the volume now I can't say I'm completely happy with this so far but I suppose once I've put the sides on it'll give me a better idea of how it's going to look I mean side on it doesn't look too bad it's sort of reminiscent of the old scots and some of the old uh, flat tank nortons um the other thing i was planning to do was to take the tank across here and up to there and fill this void here but looking at it there's actually a fair bit of volume there it's not going to be flat it's going to come in to the top there but there is a reasonable volume because that's half of it and of course the other half is around the other side that's it's going to be um, easy to sit on the bike it's not going to get in the way at all so that's no problem and it's not made the bike any wider and it means that lovely top curve of the top tube isn't hidden and neither is the engine because I think if you put a normal tank on you would expect the bottom of the tank to run about there so it would have to have a big hole in for the engine so what, what I'm thinking about at the moment I'm trying to decide whether that's the, the shape I want because I could come from here straight down to here and and so extend this further forward and come up there what i have been quite careful to do is to make the angle of this bottom of the tank match the angle of that top uh, plate there so at least there's a bit of a bit of synergy like it all fits together so i think what i'm going to do i'm going to put the sides on see how it looks and i'm going to make a call then about whether or not to leave it um square here or actually take it into this void because that's a useful space for things like an electric box or your waterproof or your sandwiches or something um and the other thing to, to think about is what do i do then do i just take the back of the tank in line with that post so uh, and bring that flat or do i bring it out at an angle there's still a fair bit of thinking to be done it's quite hard to sort of visualize something in 3d then make a model in 2d uh, and then put it all back together so anyway the, the jury is kind of very much out at the moment but cardboard and hot glue is a lot cheaper than aluminium and welding so um i just need to do a bit of uh, thinking anyway that's that's the latest for now more updates will follow as usual thank you for watching